Hey y'all, it's Liz. Okay, so today I'm going to show you um, how I try to conceal my dark circles up under here and also uh, my blemishes, you know, my um, just dark spots and shit that I have all over my face. As old as I am, I still get acne breakout. Can you imagine that? Anyways, so to get started, I've already um, primed my face with Monistat Chafing Gel, and I put that all over my face, and I did that about probably uh, almost 10 minutes ago, just to kind of let it set in. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take um, this uh, Cheek and Lips Eyes Makeup. It's in the color of um, orange and I'm just going to apply that up under here. I'm puffy and that's probably not going to go away but up under here where this dark circle is located at and I'm just going to put a little bit on right up under here and um, just blend that in. And just using my finger, I'm just going to cover up just that dark area. And I'm sure I could get rid of that puffiness. It's just, I just don't have the time right now. I'll be alright. So I've covered it up. I look like an orange pumpkin. Um, people use like the orange camouflage and stuff, but I'll just use this uh, makeup stuff that like for your cheeks and lips and eyes. Okay. So I've done that. Then I'm going to take um, Makeup Forever. This is the um, Camouflage Cream Palette. And it's in number five. And I'm just going to take um, this color here. And I'm going to apply that where I put that orange and I'm just gonna pat that in there to cover up the orange and I'm just trying to pat not blend you know not rub it in just kinda pat it in to cover up that orange I'm going to do it on this side. Hopefully it won't take me long to show you how I do this. Just like so. Then I'm going to also take a little bit of this and just put it, you know, just tap it where my real dark spots are. cheeks and stuff. I have it really bad on my cheeks. A lot of it is uh, just acne scars and stuff. Just like so. And right around here. Try to get around my nose, my nostrils. Okay, then what I'm going to do is take, um, I'm going to use this Matte Lumineer by Chanel, this one here, and what I'm going to do is just take a little bit on the back of my hand, I'm running out, ain't that some bullshit, I don't mean to cuss y'all, sorry, and then I'm just going to take my brush and just kind of put that all over, you know. I 
And I'm just going to put it in like this, but I'm going to go back and, and kind of um, um, swirl it in, you know, and blend it in to my skin. I'm just getting this on there right now. And I'm just going to take this little brush and just kind of buff it in all over. Then I'm going to take this brush and I'm going to put this into my um, Mineralized Skin Finished in Medium Dark and just kind of buff this in to my skin. Okay, just like so, to me, maybe not to y'all, but to me, I've covered up a lot of the dark circle, the dark color up under my eye, and so now I've got a clear, not fantastic, but i got a nice canvas to work with now. So, what I'm going to do now is um, I'm going to apply my makeup. Um, as far as the contouring goes, I... You can use whatever you have. I use this Light Sweep um, Shadester by MAC. It's got the two colors, you know, the light and the dark. And I just try to try to get it right in there. And then just blend it out a little bit because I don't... It, I know I got it looks like a harsh line, but um, just like so. So there you go, and that's it. Then I'll put on some blush, but anyways, uh, well, I can go ahead and do that. Check, why not? Why not, Liz? Why not put on a blush? 99% um, of the time I can't find the shit that I need. My daughter comes over and she wants to play around in this stuff, so. And then on my cheeks, I'm using um, the apples of my cheeks. I'm using Sweetest Cocoa by Mac. Okay? So, I just wanted to show you how I conceal those dark circles up under my eye. And um, I'll be back. I'm going to be doing, trying, I'm going to try to do a smoky look for you. All right? So, I'll be back in just a minute. You guys stay tuned. And thank you. Bye.